it's Diane de las Casas, a children's book author, a professional storyteller, and the fairy organizer of Once Upon a Storage. Today, I'm very excited to be a part of a big spring cleaning collab hosted by Tori Toth of Stylish Stagers. Tori is one of the best home stagers on YouTube, and I'm so glad that she asked me to be a part of this collab. In addition, there are many other amazing lifestyle YouTubers who are also part of this collab, and I hope you'll check them out in the description box below. So today, my video is all about spring cleaning the bed. That's right, the bed. So how do we do that? Well, let's take a look. So here's my bed all made up. Looks terrific, right? Of course she does on the surface, but she needs a good spring cleaning. So the first thing I'm gonna do is strip the bed. I'm going to remove all of the sheets and pillowcases, as well as the duvet cover, and give them a good washing. So now I've stripped my bed. I have all of the sheets that are going into the wash and I am removing my duvet cover. So in case you don't know what a duvet is, it's a cover that covers sort of like this uh, comforter insert and it has buttons and you can remove it and wash it, which is what I love about it. It's different from a comforter in that a comforter, you cannot remove it. You have the whole comforter, but with a duvet cover, you have the insert and you can remove the duvet to wash it. So after you've removed your sheets and your duvet or your comforter, presumably you have a mattress cover. You'll remove that as well and make sure you clean that. Then you're going to want to vacuum your mattress and give it a good 180 degree rotation. So many mattresses have handles on the side. It is a team job, so you're going to have someone in your family help you pick up the mattress and rotate it. It really helps to preserve the life of your mattress. The other thing that you're going to want to do is clean your dust ruffle. Then you're going to want to go underneath the bed. So I'm going to show you in a second exactly what I found underneath my bed. Scary. So underneath my bed I have this under bed storage box and in it I have um, a bunch of memories. I'm going to still put that back underneath my bed now that it's clean under there and let me show you what I found underneath my bed. Um, not all the tissue but all that dirt. Yeah, so gross. That is why you want to spring clean your bed. Okay, so one of the finishing touches that I like to do is to spray a pillow mist on my bedding. This one is called Sleep. It's Lavender Vanilla by Bath & Body Works. I am not sponsored. I just really love this and the scent is heavenly. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like this video, please give your fairy organizer a thumbs up. Please comment below and let me know how you spring clean your bed. And of course, I hope that you'll subscribe. Remember, life is too short not to sparkle. Here's to organizing and spring cleaning your bed happily ever after. Go. Come on, dude. Oh, you got a fan! <laughs> <laughs> I won. No! That's not how it works!